Hello guys, my name is Budija, and uh, today this is gonna be a long video. I'm just gonna warn you now. <laughs> and um, my birthday kind of went away two days ago, so this is more gonna be a message, I would say. But this is gonna be serious. And to anyone that is a friend, a viewer, anybody that wants to know about this, wants to get gritty into my past, stay tuned and watch. But this will be something that determines the rest of my channel and it involves you so if you want to if you don't want to be involved in anything then I would suggest going um, if you don't want to watch a depressing video or a serious video then I would go you know um, because I mean I have other videos you want to check them out but I mean obviously PewDiePie is better go watch that <laughs> so um going on to my birthday how do we start this out? So, two days ago I had my birthday, and it was amazing. We went to a renaissance fair, you know, all the dragons and all that fantasy stuff, and it was so freaking awesome. But, the thing was, the entire day it fell off. Almost in a depressed daze, and I, I didn't know why, to be honest. I just, oh, and it was so fun. So, when I got home, I just, I, I almost stared at the mirror. All, nah, I shouldn't say all day, but you know what I mean. I just kept staring. I kept staring at myself, and I kept wondering, why do I feel this? Why do I feel so empty? I, today was amazing. What have I done wrong? And I, I just kept sitting there. So I kept thinking and thinking, and I kept thinking about my past. And eventually, I looked back at my last birthday. I got three things. My best friends, my most loyal best friends back. That cared about me even when I was gone. Take away from my home. I got my home back. <laughs> and then my dream came true. Something that everyone said at my last school, at this school I should say, <laughs> my bad. You can't do it. You'll always be the same this dream you will never be able to accomplish focus on school focus on sports eventually it'll be over what do you want to look forward to in your career days oh you too stupid I proved them wrong and that made me happy not in like a revenge way but that I proved that I could do what I wanted, that I could make my dream come true when I wanted, whenever I wanted. I could, I almost influenced myself, by myself, and you guys, and that made me so happy. It was a dream come true, like like in a storybook where the superhero has to fight off the bad guy, and somehow he's in the end, and he actually makes it. I'm sorry, I'm getting, I'm getting silly. <laughs> so, and then I looked to uh, what happened after that. I made it all happen. Everyone got pissed off. They were like, oh my god, he's actually making this happen. And everyone tried stopping me. You need to get back into sports. You should be stupid. You had a good run. But I was not done. I remember the first day of school, and everyone kind of gave, gave me stared days, like, why are you back? Or, um... How did you reach 1,000? You know? It was like as if I was a ghost risen from the dead, you know? So. I kind of felt pretty cool, to be honest. <laughs> but. I keep saying but, I'm sorry. <laughs> so. Moving on. My family after that pretty much was against me. Um. I, I didn't want to do sports. I made it clear that I wanted to do YouTube. That I was going to fight for this dream. And I kept getting rejected over and over and over. And I, I'm going to be honest. I almost stopped completely. Because I, I was tired of being harassed. And that's what I was happening. My friends were stopping me. My family. Everyone. Just complete strangers. Even my fans were telling me that. Hey, you know what? You had a good run. You should stop. And I'm not going to stop. If you guys know me. 
from wherever. I'm probably one of the most determined people. And maybe that sounds cocky coming from me. But if you know me, that's how I am. I will not stop on this train. Ever. I may ask for help, but I will not stop. And this year had to be one of the worst years ever. I, I, I came home, and finally all these good things happened. They broke right in front of me. I lost my friends that I thought were loyal. I lost my best friend who betrayed me and backstabbed me. After I tried giving him everything, when I trusted him with everything, I gave him, <laughs> I lost some of my fans, which I don't care, to be honest. I care, but if they're not going to be loyal, then go. Now I understand that. And I'm happy that I still have a thousand, because those are the loyal people that stayed with me. And overall, I was just simply hated. I was fading away. And by the end of everything, by midway through the year, I looked at myself and I was like, why do I feel dead? So then, after that, I just finally realized that I was back from the beginning. The first time I was on YouTube, I was back. It was the exact same. Maybe I had more subs, but when I looked in the mirror, I understood that I was alone again. And nothing could change that. I'm not, I'm not asking for pity, because that's, that was the truth. Nobody was really behind me. Everyone forced me to stop. And it, I pretty much did. I kept putting out a few more videos, you know, throwing them, throwing them, throwing them, but that was why I lost. People pretty much told me to stop, and I, I got scared, and I pretty much broke. So, here we are, midway through summer, and nothing's changed, really. I, I lost everything, and I'm back to square one. I, I felt almost just as alone. And when this birthday came up, when I thought everything was going to be great, it was just a simple reminder that pure happiness, that was a special occurrence. But then I noticed it was something that I earned. Something that you guys gave me, happiness. It's because every day that I woke up, there's always a friend there saying, hey, you want to hang out? Or... Online, I feel more alive there than anywhere else. And if you know me, that, that is true. I feel more alive online, doing YouTube, making these videos, making people happy, than anything else. It's another thing is, what, even if there's one person watching me, no matter what, as long as you're loyal, as long as you're a good person, that needs the help, that n needs laughter, that needs someone, that's why I do YouTube, because even if there are millions, billions of other YouTube channels, if I could be the one person that helps, that makes a difference in someone's life, because of them being alone and just somehow landing on me, then so be it. If I can make someone's day, when they feel everything is lost, then that made me happy. And just knowing that if I started falling, you guys had my back. Which you did. You did. And you pushed me to my dream. And I'm so thankful for that. But then we broke. And I don't know what happened. It, it happened so quick. We are back to square one. And um, I had this uh, bucket list when I formed it at school. <sighs> what I wanted for my birthday and for to do over the summer. And here are my dreams. <laughs> bucket list of summer. Reach 10,000 subscribers before the end of 2015. Um, there's a star right there. <laughs> Get a new microphone. 
mark that off. Get it, Aaron, add that. Mark that off. Get video to 10,000 views. Not yet happening, but we can do it. Get the gang back together. Um, that's like all my friends that I used to hang out with. I, I just want to make a gang, you know. For some reason, like, I find friends and they just leave. I find another good friend and they just leave. I want to get everyone together, make a gang, and just always be. Yeah. <laughs> um, go to a big fun event. We already did that, just like I said. I felt. Upload at least one time every single day. I'm not going to make a video where I feel sad and force myself to smile. It's, that's obvious. Series with my dogs. There's my dogs already. He, he, it's too dark though. <laughs> um, 2017 montage. I'm so happy I did that. Yes. And then fan art at the beginning of every single video. Nobody really makes me fan art anymore. And that I don't blame them though. There's nothing really to make it about. <laughs> so. And then the most important. What made me happy. What gave me joy? Prove every one wrong. After everything, I proved everyone wrong that day. The day of my birthday. And even though I had your guys' help, we proved the world wrong. That even though I started from the bottom, we reached the top. And even though there, there might have been a YouTuber getting 10 million views that day, or 100,000 subscribers that day, we did so much better. Why? Because we're not like them. We did it the right way, and we pushed ourselves. We actually fought for that. We earned it, unlike everyone else. And I want to get back to that. I want to fight for this dream, and I, if you guys know me, I will not give up, and I never do. I fight for what I want, and I earn it. If I want something, I take my hand, and I grab it. I need you guys. I need you guys' help. I need you guys to give me a push to make this dream become a reality. Because without you, there's no way this dream can get anywhere. I need you guys every day to give me that motivation, to tell me that we can make it. Because that's what happened last time. You guys kept making me happy. You guys kept pushing me, telling me what I can and cannot do. And we flew to the stars. And I know I'm just some kid behind this computer screen. But to me, just for a moment, don't think about these cameras right here, these, these stupid things, these monitors, or even the headset. Just imagine just looking at me right now. Just being you guys. Me and you. And we're going to make this dream happen. We. This is our dream. And even though it seems impossible to reach 10,000, th that's literally times 10 of our, la of our number right now. And I'm not saying it's going to be easy. We only got four months left. Four. But I cannot do this alone. That's what I'm doing right now. I need your help. And if you think that if you do something, I will not notice. I can promise you, every little bit of effort you put in, I notice. A view, a like, a subscribe. Whenever you're there for me, I notice. I notice if you are doing anything for me. And I am so thankful for that. People that have been here since the very beginning, I notice you. Without you, I am nothing. So that's why I'm asking for your help to make this dream 
happen. Push me. What is my birthday wish? I want to make my dream come true. That's my birthday wish. And if you guys can help me do that, give me that push again. Reunite ties with me. Help me find my friends again. Prove the world wrong. Rise from the ashes. Let's do it. Because of these, we started a dream. <laughs> and it's not over yet. This journey ain't up. done by far. So, you don't have to help, obviously. You can just click on the video and leave. But if you want to help, if you want to make YouTube the way it was again, where it's always someone helping each other, not just people making videos, hating at each other. Help me make this dream come true. Let's earn the way YouTube is supposed to be. And I promise, if you help me, I will try my best to make YouTube the way it should be. A place where people can find friends, be there for each other, find a place where, when they feel not belonged, they can go there, find a community, find a friend. Help me make my dream come true, so I can make other people's dreams come true. Like I said, it would be a long video, and I know it's been a long video, even boring. But, to everybody that's made this part, thank you. To everybody who isn't, well, I don't blame you. There's no music. I'm speaking from the heart, and this is an unedited video. I want to speak to you. Not as a person trying to get views or anything. I want views. But that's not what this video's intent was. It was to speak to you human to human, heart to heart. And anybody that's still watching. To you that are still watching. I know you're there watching. I can tell. Thank you so much for being there for me. And this will be a hard journey. But every step you take, if you need help, I'll pull you back up. And that is my promise to you. If you stay along with this journey. I do not abandon. Suppose that. So let's make this dream come true. You're not there? Okay. But if you are. It would be one of the hardest things. That you would probably have to do. But once we reach the top. We reached the top. We, nobody else. We, we made it through the hardest of the hard. <laughs> Let's make the impossible happen, guys. So, tell your friends go somewhere, try to get people to help. Tell me what you think I should do. Contribute. If you want to help. And if you don't know how to help, talk to me. I am here. This video is getting way too long. <laughs> but, I'm serious. We will reach 10,000. We. I can't do it. I can't do it alone. Only you can prevent forest fires. <laughs> Only you help me make this dream come true. So. There's only one way to go now. And that's up. My name is Blue Sign Out. And I'll see you guys. In the next video. <sighs> Let's prove everyone wrong. My name is Blue can't get it right. My name is Blue Digit, signing out.
finally got it right. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.